If you're currently facing issues with your mouse keep constantly disconnecting and reconnecting in Windows 11, I'm going to show you how to fix this. I know it can be really frustrating and annoying. So stick around and watch the entire video so that you can learn how to fix these annoying problems within Windows. Before we jump in guys, would you mind taking a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button because this will let me know that you found value within this video. And on top of that, the biggest benefit is that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Now, let's continue. So guys, the first thing that you want to do is check for updates within your Windows PC. So what do you want to do? Right click on your Windows icon on your taskbar and go to settings. From here on the left hand side, go down to Windows Update, click on that and you want to allow your computer to check for updates. If there are any updates within Windows, you want to go ahead and install those updates once the computer check for updates and you see that there are updates available. Now, as you can see at the moment, my computer is doing the updates and it's also installing those pending updates. So this is also very good and allow my windows to be fully updated to fix any issues or bugs that may arise. Of course, there are times when windows provide updates and it comes with additional issues, but this is Microsoft's job to constantly fix those bugs going forward. And that's why we have so much Microsoft updates, right? Now, the next thing that you want to do after all of your Windows updates are done, you also want to check under the advanced option here. And from here, you want to simply go ahead and click on optional updates. So click on that and you will be able to see if you have some optional updates showing you, right? And you can always go ahead and expand these to see what are those updates available that you can go ahead and check them and install them. Right, so as you can see, I have an Intel Corporation display. I can go ahead and I can check these and I can also go ahead and install them. So if you see something related to mouse or whatever, you can go ahead and check them and then simply go ahead and click update, right? Now, the next thing you wanna do is simply right click on the Windows icon on your taskbar and go to your device manager. Now, once you're inside the device manager, you want to go down to where you have human interaction devices, expand that, and you want to choose your USB input device. I have three of these because I have three input device for USB here. So if you only have your mouse input, you will most likely see one, right? So you want to go ahead and you want to right click, for example, and go to properties. And from here under power management, you want to ensure that you uncheck this button that says allow the computer to turn off this device to save power. So if you have your mouse only connected, then you want to go ahead and ensure this. If you have multiple, then you can go ahead and you can uncheck this and then simply go ahead and click on OK, right? So you want to go ahead and do that for this option. So as I said, if you have multiple, go ahead and do so. If you have only one USB connected, which is your mouse, then go ahead and ensure that you uncheck that to turn off the power options, right? Now, the next thing you want to do is click the Windows key on your keyboard and simply type in power option. And you will see the option that says edit power plan. Click on that, then click change advanced power settings. Now, within this list, you will see if you have any option that says USB settings. And if you're able to find USB settings there, you wanna go ahead and expand that and you will have two options, one for battery and one for plugged in. You wanna go ahead and disable those, right? So you wanna go ahead and check that option to see if you have it. I have two options here, so let me see if I have the USB. I don't have it here, but if in your case, if you have any of these, you will be able to expand it. And as you can see, for example, here, you have the on battery and plugged in. So in case you check it and you have USB settings there, you want to go ahead and check that, expand it, find the option that says USB selective suspend, something, something like that, guys. And then you want to go ahead and disable both of those. Now, after you do that, guys, you want to go ahead and restart your PC. If this still does not work after restarting your PC, the next step is to go ahead and uninstall that mouse driver. And you need to do that within Device Manager. So right click again on the Windows icon in your taskbar, go back to Device Manager, and this time you want to go down to the option that says Mice and Other Device Pointing Device, expand that, and you will find the mouse option there. So what you want to do is just simply right click and do uninstall, go ahead and uninstall. And once you uninstall these, simply restart your PC, and this should fix the issue. Here you have it guys. I really hope you found value within this video. And if you do, don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.